Good evening to all. Here again at Holy Innocence. The Holy Innocence Church and School. We'll be today to the Ashford in St. Thomas. Ashford is spelled. Airway Essex, F O R D, and this is the Road to Harrison Scale by West Mahogany. The school building with the mural graphic on it, done by Miss June Connell in 2005. And you can also see the flag of Barbados on the school gate as well. National flag, national colors of Barbados on top of and over the flag with the um, plastic, things, plastic things over the school building. Uh, I mean, over the flag, the um, things the, on the line. I don't know what you call those things, but they are blue, yellow, and black. And this is the school building. And this is Old Innocence Anglican Episcopal Church, which was built in 1838 and dedicated in 1839. Built on land given by the owners of Ashford Plantation and it was built in the shape of a cross. It was built, it was one of the Coleridge chapels, Bishop Coleridge chapels of East. So, this is the road to Harrison's Cave on West Mahogany. Again, Harrison's Cave runs all underground here. That is why it is said that when service is going on in the church, that the organ vibrates into the cave. The church has two cemeteries, one in the churchyard and one on the opposite side of the road over here where this wall is. But unfortunately, the one in the churchyard is filled now, so they have to bury the people on the opposite side over here. So again, I'm in the parish of St. Thomas, which is in the center of the island. St. Thomas and St. George are the two parishes here in Barbados, in the center of the island. Best be fair to as the heart of Barbados or the central uplands of Barbados. There's an old saying that people from these parishes don't know how to swim. We also have lots of family buried in Holy Innocence Churchyard. Yeah, yeah. Mm. I have lots of family buried here at Holy Innocence. Lots of family buried here, such as my great grandparents, my aunts and uncles, my great aunt, sorry, and great uncles. And I also have distant relatives, also buried in Holy Innocent Churchyard as well. So, by the way, I have one. I, don't, I have one great aunt living. She's the only one I have living, and she's singing in the choir here at Holy Innocence. And I also have other distant family, and I have cousins, a cousin that also attends church here as well. <laughs> So Harrison's cave is just up the road here, from here, in the parish of St. Thomas as well. Harrison's cave is best referred as the eighth wonder of the world. It was built in, it was discovered in 1970 by Danish teleologist Ole Sorensen and Barbadian Tony Mason. And the process was carried out by some the rebuilding process to make it what it is today was taken out. It was taken out many years ago, back in the 70s. And some of the locals, some of the residents in the neighborhood, such as Noah Boyce and David Carrington and others who were first employed at Harrison Scape who helped make her sense to care what it is today. And 
it was it was officially opened in November of yeah 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 yeah, yeah. it was officially opened on the 28th of November 1981 by the Prime Minister of Barbados then Prime Minister Tom Adams who was a member of Parliament for the parish of St Thomas at the time and it is now owned by the government of Barbados well, the Innocence Primary School was taught by some great teachers as well, such as Mr. Lester Vaughan, Lester St. Clair Vaughan, SCM. He was the one who wrote the National Pledge of Barbados. He was the principal of well, the Innocence School. Born in 1916 and died in 2003. There is a school here in Barbados, in the same parish of St. Thomas, named after Lester Vaughan, the Lester Vaughan Memorial Secondary School, which is at Tian Garden. St. Thomas, and it was also taught by Miss Orsi Springer, who used to teach little children. She lives in the States now, she's also from St. Thomas, and Miss Holder was the principal here as well. And also, Mr. Weir Padash also taught by the school as well. So, Lester Vaughan was the principal of Paul Anderson back in the 50s and 60s. Paul Anderson Church. And this pavement process was started, started paving here, started in the this pavement process started paving here in the between late 2014, between late 2013 and early 2014 when they started paving. We had to remove this um they removed the pavement. We removed the church wall, sorry, and placed it here. Placed it back and placed the, pav placed the pavement here. The pavement started from here all the way up to Harrison's Cave. Started from late 2013, uh, between late 2013 and early 2014 when they started paving the, the road here. So as I said before, this is my only mother, my family from my mother's side are from. They were all born and raised in this area, in this parish of St. Thomas, in the nearby Rational Hall. Thanks for watching now. And have a blessed evening.